My name is Ash, and this is my wife, Cindy, um, and we've been attending Faith Bridge for nine years for me since we got married, but um, I believe you've been, you've been coming here from before that as well. So, I'm Don, and this is Maura Vaughn, and we uh, are members of Faith Bridge and have joined the church some two and a half years ago. We've been blessed, and we've had good parents and good educations, and we worked hard, and we were successful, and we were financially uh, rewarded, and, uh, and, and now we're retired. We give and have been generous through our life with our family and friends and associations, but somehow or another, we fail to focus on mm -hmm. the Christian responsibility and tithing, and uh, something was beginning Missing. to tell mm -hmm. us that uh, uh, that we need to revisit this and look at our our priorities and uh, and uh, etc cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, I would have to say when we first got married, we gave, but um, I would have to say it wasn't a heart thing. It was more of a discipline thing. It wasn't a cheerful give. It wasn't out of um, this is this is God. I guess things changed for us um, when when we started walking with the Lord more intimately and more closely. As we just kind of grew in our walk with Him, He just began to work through us, which was just really powerful, because then it was, all of a sudden it clicked in our minds that it's all His. It became something that we wanted to do, not just something that we needed to do. And, but there was a, again, a, a, a stirring inside of Moore and I to not just say, what's the minimum requirement for tithing, or, you, you know, but what can we do to help? It was a natural thing. It, it came to a point where, do you trust the Lord or do you not? Uh, and if you're gonna say you trust Him, do you trust Him with, with your salvation? you trust Him with your kids? But then when it comes to my money, I don't. And it didn't make sense. It was always either you do or you don't. That was the, 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 the choice that, that the Lord gave us is you can, you can go about your life and you'll be successful, but do you really want to be part of what I'm doing in people's lives and, and building the kingdom? And that mindset was, was a huge shift for us. It's not something where we think, oh, we're going to have to do this. Now it's, okay, Lord, how can you use us through this? We sat down and, 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 and did yeah. some, some number crunching and said, yeah, this is what we can do. This is what we, and we can do some more. And that's what we want to do. And, and we're comfortable that, that this is what God had asked us to do. And, and so we've made that commitment yeah. now. And, uh, and they're always reminded that this, in Faith Bridge, we do it cheerfully. Sure, and, yeah. and, we did it cheerfully and we take great joy out of our decision and what we've done on giving to, to yes. paper. And it comes down to this, if we're gonna call ourselves disciples of Christ, if we're gonna call ourselves followers of Him, um, are we willing to partake and be part of His mission in the world or not? And I wanna be part of that because that's, that's what I want to have as a legacy. That's what I would like to have um, as, as my story more than anything else.